Hi, I'm Mike Chappelle, Senior Application Engineer with St. Cobain Abrasives. We're here today to talk about our newest product, the Fixed Abrasive Buff. Our FAB product, which stands for Fixed Abrasive Buff, is made up of multiple meanings. The first, fixed, means the fact that we have permanently applied abrasive grain to the surface of a non-woven cloth. The abrasive part means that we've put silicon carbide as the grain on the fixed abrasive buff. The buff is made up of the OD of the buff, the ID of the buff, or the clinch ring, the arbor hole of the buff, which will go onto the spindle. The other items then are the ply, which is the number of pieces of material that are on the buff. These are normally divisible by four. It's eight, 12, and 16 are the standard sizes. It's critical that we know what they're using in ply and the type of material that they're currently using. The fixed abrasive buff comes in one type of cloth with the same 29 micron. The next item we need to know is the pack. This is the density or the waviness of the buff. It's important to know that because we come in different densities between a zero and a one, which is a fairly flat buff, to a two and a four, which is a buff that has a lot of waviness and a lot of density. If we know all these items, it makes it much easier for us to be able to specify the correct fixed abrasive buff product. Today, the fixed abrasive buff competes with other cloth buffs, but the other cloth buffs do not contain a fixed abrasive on it. In order to get the cut needed, a regular cotton or poly cotton buff has to have compound applied to it continuously, where the fixed abrasive buff needs only a minimal amount just to keep the surface cool. The rest of the cutting and mirror finish creation comes from the silicon carbide grain that's embedded in the surface. The fab is designed to be used in industries where robotics, automatic, and semi-automatic equipment is used. The reason for this is for the ability to have control in several different areas. The first control is speed control. Our buff needs to be able to run between 2,500 and 3,500 surface feet, where today's buffs oftentimes run twice that speed. The control on the compound is also essential. We have the ability oftentimes to reduce compound between 50 and 90%. These controls are essential and are most often found in robotic, automatic, and semi-automatic equipment. The ability to control pressure is also essential. We need the, the ability to allow for penetration of about a half inch to three quarter inch with the fixed abrasive buff. This allows for the silicon carbide grain that's built into the cloth to be able to put in contact with the substrate, thus allowing for improved cut and life. Fixed abrasive buff, because it uses considerably less compound, has shown to be able to enhance any after buffing cleaning operation. This is done because the amount of compound left over from the fixed abrasive buff operation is between 50 and 70% less uh, than the surface of a normal buff with the normal amount of compound. This turns into a significant cost reduction in the after buffing cleaning operation. We are happy to lead the way with this patented innovative new product, 